My name is Dr. Robert Frank, and I'm a professor of pediatrics in the Division of Infectious Diseases at Cincinnati Children's. Cincinnati Children's is one of um, eight sites in the country that has a um, program with the National Institute of Health to test um, new vaccines, and so that we were um, selected based on our uh, very good results we've had with past trials. We'll be uh, enrolling approximately 100 adults and 100 uh, children in the study here. Um, this study is being uh, put as a fast track with the NIH, and so what's happening is that after two weeks, we're going to do a first safety check, and then um, if everything looks good with that, then we're going to move on to the pediatrics. Um, for the adult studies, we're going to be doing a blood test uh, a month after the first dose, a month after the second dose, and a month after the, the third dose, and so that our final results would be um, hopefully in about two to three. People need to understand is that the, um, this novel H1N1 or the swine flu vaccine is made just like the seasonal flu vaccine, and so the side effects that we'd be expecting from this vaccine would be just like um, a seasonal flu vaccine is that as it's a shot, there may be a little bit of pain at the site, maybe a little redness. Um, that some people um, complain of a little bit of achiness, maybe a low-grade fever for a day or so. But because it's a killed vaccine, it cannot give you the actual flu. Um, okay. You're not contagious to anyone else. I signed up for the study to help further research on this vaccine to see how it's going to affect the experience getting vaccinated. It was it was okay. okay. It was just a light stick. It didn't hurt. Um, hesitations on getting vaccinated. No, My experience was easy, uh, painless, and um, I thought signing up to help uh, the community and also people across uh, the United States would be beneficial. I have four children that I'm going to sign up for the children's part of the study, um, them to be a part of the study, and hopefully um, the vaccination helps prevent them from getting swine flu. This